Hi everybody. I just wanted to take the time to give you a tour of my pantry because I know a lot of people ask me and they wanna see what it is that I eat, what we keep in stock so that we can easily make healthy food. So here we go. We do not have a huge pantry, um, which is fine. It really works just perfect for us. Um, it's just not very deep, but it kind of actually makes it a little bit easier. So our first row is just empty extra coffee mugs. As you can see, we like coffee. Um, the next row is our pre-made foods ready to eat. Um, normally we just split it in half, so I take this side, Josh takes this side. Um, I just have some tuna, peanut butter, hemp seeds, oats, um, some little bags of trail mix. I like to put mine in little baggies so that I don't eat the entire bag. Um, this is the bread that I usually get from Costco. A lot of the food that we have is from Costco. Um, I like this one because it has a lot of fiber in it. Um, but yeah, we usually shop at Costco, at Kroger, Sprouts, and Walmart, so a wide variety of places. Um, these chickpeas are just something tasty to snack on that I really like. They are from Costco as well. Um, and then Josh aside, he has some trail mix, str uh, fruit strips, protein bars, bread, more trail mix, and cereal. Um, as you can see, we don't have a ton of extra ready to go foods. Um, that's just because we plan what we're gonna eat for the week ahead of time, or maybe even the month, I guess, if we go to Costco. Um, and by doing that, it doesn't leave us a lot of leftover food. So I like that because it makes sure that we don't have a lot of waste. Um, down here are the foods that we usually have in stock. So we have some taco shells. We have some bone broth. There's this paleo birch benders mix that I like to use. Um, not the biggest fan of alternative sweeteners, but I do like this mix. It's easy to have on hand for pancakes, waffles, and biscuits. Um, spring roll wrappers. These are fun to, to make lunch or dinners with. We have little ones and big ones. We have some potatoes. We're using that for dinner tonight to go along with our burgers. Um, brown rice pasta. We also have some black rice and some quinoa. This is usually stuff that we have on hand. Easy to throw in some frozen veggies, cook it up with some meat, and it makes a quick dinner. And then this is our cooking supplies. So we use coconut oil, cooking spray, canola oil, apple cider vinegar, extra virgin olive oil, and balsamic vinegar. Um, down here are all of our spices. I have them in order of alphabetical order. Um, I'd say probably for the most part we always use black pepper. I like spice, so cayenne pepper as well. I'm obsessed with cinnamon and I probably put it in most things, so that's why we have such a big one from Costco. Um, and then we always use garlic and onion and ginger. Oh, and paprika. So as you can see, we use most of these spices um, in our cooking. Um, down here is just some baking items. So we have some cornstarch, baking powder, baking soda. We have some cocoa powder, coconut sugar, and then we have some tea over here. I always like to end the night drinking tea. Um, then we just have like bags and different things to wrap up our food. And down here, we have some popcorners. Um, again, something from Costco. It's a, we always like to try out a new snack for the month, so that's our choice for this month. And then we have these King's Hawaiian Rolls. This is to make for some friends for Steeplechase this weekend. Um, so again, as you can see, it's not a ton. We don't have a ton of stuff, um, but what we do have, we use so that we don't have to waste any food. So. I hope you enjoyed the little tour and let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.